Investor.com presents Investing Tips, Bird Dogging, The New Wholesaling Career, by Colin Egbert with Hope Hammond. There is a new real estate term in town. It's called bird dogging. And no, it's not about hunting hounds. Bird dogging is the practice of hunting down potential wholesaling leads for other real estate investors and just getting paid a finder's fee for the assignment of contract or just the lead itself. This is a great way for those just starting a wholesaling business to learn the ropes. Many seasoned investors bring in a lot of their properties and wholesaling leads through the assistance of their bird dogs, who are new investors just learning how to make money by flipping houses. This practice of bringing in wholesaling leads benefits both the experienced wholesaler by saving them a lot of time in searching for leads and the new investor by giving them an easy way to learn wholesaling while at the same time giving them the chance to pick up some cash. To get started, you'll need to find yourself a mentor or real estate investor who is willing to take a new investor under their wing in exchange for time and effort. These aren't investors who charge a fee for mentoring. These are investors who will get you involved in the nitty-gritty work of searching out wholesaling leads. You'll be able to find such investors through the classifieds. Look out for ads offering to buy unwanted or foreclosed homes. These are usually posted by the kind of investor who could use a bird dog. Let the investor know you are looking to get started in wholesaling by referring leads to them. If they're interested, make sure you find out all of their particulars, such as what kind of properties they prefer, where they are looking for property, and what they are willing to pay for the home. Plus, find out what they'll offer you in finder's fees. 3000 bucks is a good finder's fee. In exchange for working with a seasoned real estate investor to make money flipping houses, you'll have to be willing to do the legwork. That means networking to find properties that homeowners are selling on the cheap and going to look at the property and even negotiating a potential price with the homeowners. You may also have to work to get the homeowner under an agreement to sell contract before approaching the real estate investor with your lead. You may have to offer the real estate investor that you are working with up to 20 leads before they'll find one that's acceptable. The task of learning your wholesaling business takes a lot of time. With every lead that the investor turns down, you'll find that you learn a little bit more about the business. The investor will have to spend time with you to explain why a property isn't acceptable. It may mean taking a lot of time out of their day, but in exchange, the real estate investor is getting someone else to search out properties for him or her. To learn more about real estate and wholesaling, head to realestateinvestingwholesales.com.